This soft-shelled Florida native is in high demand across the globe. We're seeing five to 15,000 pounds of turtle meat per week being shipped out of uh, airports in South Florida. And those are alarming numbers to wildlife activists who say China's appetite for the amphibians used in food and medicine is threatening their survival in Florida. Females can take 10 years to reach sexual maturity. So if you start removing all the adult females from a population, it's nearly impossible for them to recover from that. In light of those concerns, the state's Wildlife Commission has temporarily limited turtle hunters to a catch of 20 soft shells a day. But some claim that's still too many. What the commission did was ask the turtle harvesters how many turtles per day they need to harvest to stay in business. And that's what the number is based on. Our figures show that the percentage of the turtles being taken from the wild is only 10 percent or less than 10 percent. The rest of them that are being exported come from um, commercial farms. The state calls the current limit a conservative one. Meanwhile, Matt Aresco is pushing for a moratorium on turtle harvesting in order to determine just how many Florida soft shells can be taken while allowing the rest of the population to survive. Ed Donahue, The Associated Press.